Hello everyone, welcome back to Command Wolf Gaming, I'm CWG and welcome to Space Crew. This is uh, a game made by the same, I think it was called Runner Duck, right? Uh, produced by the same company that actually made uh, Bomber Crew. Now in last week's episode we just kind of like got familiar with it, made sure we cleared all the, you know, uh, weird uh, tutorial stuff so we can skip over that, right? And we're now ready to do some more obviously i got some medium risk uh, missions here i do want to do these just to get some more cash in our account so we can buy some better equipment right because we're only at 95 credits we have th uh, 3500 research so i just kind of want to do that i do want to do the rescue astro uh, astro blah, 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 astronomer so we're going to do that um so we got a hard way in a uh easy way so we're going to do that now, our crew is already equipped with, like, oxygen masks, just in case uh, oxygen does go out. So, that's uh, going to be good. This is our the Wolf's Den ship. Uh, we're going to get ourselves launched here. And I'm going to get my crew set up accordingly because I do have a certain pattern I like to have them at. So, we're going to get them situated accordingly. Give me a second. All right, so we got two ideas here. We can do the safest route or we can do the fastest route. I think in either case, we'll encounter uh, creatures. So we're just going to take uh, the fastest route. And uh, hopefully we don't get too screwed over here. In fact, I got to put shields up. Of course, increase enemy activity. So we have uh, the two gunners on the front and back on the laser cannons, right? And then we have the engineer and also the, the whatever this guy is, the oh security chief on the side guns, right? Because I think it'll be more beneficial for us to have uh, our gunners on the back and front cannons so that they get a wider spread. So. In fact, uh, when I can afford it, I'm going to switch out one of the guns, uh, one more back gun, to have also a Gatling option as well. Alright, Klein is a little beat up here, so I'm going to get him healing. Right? So while he's healing up, I'm just gonna get our system charged here. Klein should be healed up in a second here. And then we'll head right back to the next location. This is uh, Professor Scott, the Prometheus. I'm an only survivor on the crew requesting assistance. All right, we're coming in for assistance. The wolf's den is here. Come aboard. Thanks for the rescue. The outpost is ready to. Oh shoot! We're self-destructive. Destructive. Okay, we're we're gonna try to escape quickly. Um, we're gonna go safest, quickly. Charging, engaging, let's get out of here. <laughs> okay, this is supposed to be the safest route, so hopefully we can get there. <laughs> Hopefully we do not encounter anybody or encounter any aliens. Okay, cool. Goddamn rocks. I gotta really uh, increase the shield somehow. 
we go. And let's get to the next point. Oh, we got enemies in combat. Great. Okay, Martin, you also put this fire, please. Thank you. You get back on guys. I don't think we will not need it. Defensive. I think we're good. Alright. Let's get the flock out of here. That was too easy. Alright. Let's charge up. And get out of here. Alright, we're back at Earth Station. We rescued our, uh, I guess, commander, corporate, whatever you want to call, uh, call them. So, that was a nice quick run. That's what I was looking for. 2,000 gold so we can upgrade stuff. So we can upgrade our gear. So if I go down to our engineer here, I can go and I can find... Oh, radiation. I can do radiation. Equip set balance for increased movement and repair speed. What is this? Standard issue equipment for your crew members. Okay, thanks. Thanks for telling me that. How about custom loadout here? Look, what do we got here? So, this is... Minus 5 speed. 10% radiation. Um, what do I have right now? Minus 10 speed, but 10 armor. Uh, I think I'm going to equip uh, him with a uh, radiation suit just in case. He doesn't have any armor, but at least he'll uh, be able to protect himself against uh, like do when he's doing repairs. Now, we do have some weapons upgrades, right? It looks like we got the MK2 uh, cannons unlocked and also the phasma cannons, uh, level 2 phasma. Um, now, I did say I wanted to upgrade the front cannon and the back cannon i think um maybe we should do the rear cannon first right because they do encounter the enemies i think more often than the front so we'll upgrade that then auto cannon on the side can we do that oh. all right let's try to do another run and see where we get to So we actually got a actual mission here, clear out Phasmid Forces. I'm just gonna hit that because it does give us some reward. Um, I could do one of these medium rests, but I don't know how long that would take. So we're just gonna do that one instead. All right, so it looks like we got enemies coming in here. We are objective to the zone. I did tell the pilot to do defensive maneuvers. I am going to tell uh, our gunners to do focus fire to uh, uh, punish the enemies a little harder. So, again, our rear turret actually has uh, the three cannons for the shield. So, hopefully, we can just punch through these enemy shields at a faster pace here. Okay. 
we're doing good, we're doing good. We really needed to get out of that belt. Nope. I don't want to do anything offensive yet because uh, I don't think we're really like super uh, equipped for that, so. Let's get to the next objective area. We gotta clear out these forces. Doesn't look like anybody's hurt, so yeah, we'll get there. All right, there's the enemies. They're incoming right now. I am not telling Klein to uh, do 100% fire efficiency, at least not yet. Okay, now I'm done. There we go. I just wanted the enemies close enough so that uh, once the shields are punched through, our auto cannons at the side can actually uh, deal with some devastating punishment to break the shields. There we go. This is working out. Those guys are really far away though. anymore. There we go. That's right. Punish those enemies. That's good. Fine work. I don't know why you would so stuck on that one, but okay. Well, probably because the like is that all of them? Seriously, that was it. So easy. All right. I'm guessing we got to go back to base, so let's go back to base. Oh, we got some phasma technology that we're gonna check out over there. So we're just gonna try to go move in there. Get it. And then hopefully we can get back to base in one piece. So far we're so good, you know. But uh, you never know what's gonna happen. It's like the asteroids are like chasing after us or something. Weird. Like look at that. Okay. Comms. Scan it. Okay, move you to over here. Never mind, get back. Defensive posture. Klein and uh, Martin, you know what to do. Focus fire on enemy fighters. Alright, we're gonna call in for fighter support. Go. We should have some ally fighters come in shortly. Oh my god, come on. Where, where are these guys? Well, there's our allies. Took their sweet time getting here. Sweet. So, what was I doing? I think I had to go to the thing. Oh wait, didn't I have to do something with this? Like pick it up, uh... I thought I had to pick that up. Alright, whatever. I guess not. Yay! <laughs> we did another good job. Very good. Fastman Tech scanned. Zero credits for it, but 750 research. That's not bad. So that gave us a bunch... Bump in research, at least. And also, all our uh, guys got... Oh, weapon overdrive? Sweet. These powered boots provide some additional mobility to wear. These gloves provide good protection to the wearer at the expense of mobility. Low performance engines. Okay. Ooh! Plasma cannon and auto cannon. That's what I've been wanting. Uh, and I think I'm going to put that on the front of the ship. Let me just check the crew real quick here. So, 
And supposedly we got more equipment here. Let's go to customize. I keep doing the engineer because I feel like the engineer is going to need the most. Okay, so that's armor. And this is mobility? Yeah, I think that's mobility. This is just armor. So I think I'm going to increase his mobility. In, in fact, the this officer as well going to increase her mobility. And then with her... Did we have anything here? Headgear... Oh, yeah, gloves, yes. We're going to equi uh, equip everybody else with gloves. With the metal gloves. Besides um, our regular mechanic here. In fact, we're also going to equip um, these guys with these uh, boots. Okay, cool. Now let's go down to spacecraft. Let's see what we have in the spacecraft area. So we can get engines upgrade and we can get weapons upgrade. Let's just check out the engines real quick. Standard engine. So this is a low performance engine designed for safety. It allows moderate evasiveness and is not well armored when damaged. Radiation emissions are very low. Ooh boy. Um, I can't even afford it anyway because I just spent a whole bunch of money on the equipment. So hmm. Uh, let's just check out weapons so we can do the mk2 or mk1 which is actually a quite cheap the 825 right that's not that bad and since i usually put a gunner in the front here so it might be the best choice if i have um this installed on the front because then they can swap between the phasma rifle and the gatlin gun so and i think that's about it for today thank you guys for tuning in today here on command wolf gaming hope you enjoyed the footage did you guys know that about 95 percent of you guys are not subscribed to the channel yet that's right 95 percent of you guys are not subscribed to the channel yet so make sure to hit that big red subscribe button uh, down below and check out some more stuff on my channel that you might find entertaining like i got bomber crew i got scrap mechanic i got trail makers i got several other games that i can't remember off the top of my head um um, I think one was called ba -ba -ba -ba. Um, The Spy Who Shrunk Me. I had Suicide Guy. I have a couple of different things. I'm even doing Teardown right now. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure to check that out. Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in. As always, like, subscribe, share, spread the love, and hope to see you next time here on Command World Gaming. Bye bye now. <laughs>